He has served 20 years of a minimum 30-year sentence for the murder of his ex-girlfriend. But now James Covington says he's not the same person he was and wants to be released from prison. It has taken Mr. Covington 20 plus years to be able to demonstrate, and in this case demonstrate to this court, that he has changed from who he was. Covington pleaded guilty to the 1999 murder of Deborah Duncan. Prosecutors say he strangled her, stuffed her body in his closet, and dumped her in a cemetery in Massachusetts the next day. I did three tours in combat in my career in military. Nothing I saw during those combat tours was anything as vile as what he did. I don't think he should ever walk free. By law, Covington is allowed to ask that the final third of his sentence be suspended. His lawyer says he's been a model prisoner, that he's taken responsibility for what happened and is truly sorry. But the victim's family is firmly against any leniency. Your Honor, I'm asking you to make the defendant serve his full sentence because for my family, this is our life sentence. For us, there is no parole. So I'm asking you to be compassionate to our family. What you did can't be undone. You claim to be sorry, and you claim you didn't mean it, but your actions say otherwise. Covington tried to read a statement in court today, but stopped and his lawyer read it into the record. The judge said he would make a decision on reducing the sentence at a later date. Reporting live, I'm Mandy Hershberger, WMUR News 9.